Great morning, everyone. Oh my goodness. We are at Friday. Don't forget tomorrow is Hogali time again. So today we're going to pull from the Zodiac reading cards. This is our oracle today that we're going to use. And let's see what we have here. So the pointing of the day is today is eclipse in Gemini. It's a time to rise to challenges as a new path opens. It's about negotiation, okay? It's about what are you manifesting in your world? It's about the tower. Now in this reading, I see the tower as basically the ego structure. So what is it that you're bringing into your world situation? Time to look at it because it's a time now for renewal. Do you like that one? Renewal for having a bit more control. So what are we going to do to renew and have better control, something that's going to feed you its harmony, enjoying life with music, love, and romance. So uh, look at what you're manifesting in your world, and it's time to bring in some more harmonious type things, and also bring it in with passion, okay? We're going to a uh, passionate, intense, or mysterious phase. So you have a new, new thing coming in, negotiating with harmony and passion, putting the sun on it. Again, coming out with the energy and the light to what? Dazzle, to dazzle. So today is about, again, creating more harm harmony in your life with passion, okay? And just look at see what you've been bringing into your life. What is, if it's not the things that you want and you want to have a bit maybe control, this can also be, bear can also be instead of just controlling, it's about protection. And the way you protect yourself is again, through having more harmony rather than disharmony, fighting with things, find the way that you can come into harmony with things. You know, it's the same thing when we're dealing with people. Don't look at what you are, um, the things that you are uh, in, in odds about, look at what you can come together with. Look at the things that you can actually um, agree with and start there. So again, it comes back to harmony and passion and negotiating what it is that you want. And you know, so important to have harmony and passion in your life. Be passionate about, and if you're not passionate, then find something that you can be passionate about. Because if you're in harmony with things and you're passionate about it, it's not work, okay? Then it's something that you are enjoying and that you can put your full attention and intention into to move forward and you will be much happier in your life if you can do that. So time to renegotiate, things are moving. Now we know that we're coming up with some um, that, that we're going to be going into pretty soon, very water cycles, which can be very emotional, can also be psychic. So for those that are going towards light, you can be opening more vistas for that, but you have to remember to remain in emotional balance because for those that are emotionally imbalanced, they're gonna have a much more difficult time um, for these next, what did, what did Hogarth say, 20 years? <laughs> this is a big cycle, okay? Big cycle is coming. So this is really a good time to renegotiate, understand you're going on a new path, things are opening up, 
And so what are you going to bring into it? Are you going to bring more negativity, fighting against, or are you going to try to find more harmonious things that you can be passionate about and channel those things into a positive direction? So thanks for tuning in, and I'll see you online.